Welcome to Mind Lore for Growing Minds. I am your host Bharti and today we will delve into a fascinating tool called the Adventure Quest. A way for you and your children to achieve various levels in your own game of life. So grab your adventures hat and let's begin our journey. One of the most effective strategies parents can use to support their children's development is focusing on short term goals as stepping stones towards long term aspirations. The concept of adventure quest helps in making this journey not only achievable but also thrilling. Why short term goal goals matter? They are like checkpoints in a video game. They offer immediate challenges that are manageable for a child providing regular feedback and a sense of accomplishment. The small wins keep motivation high and make the journey toward a large, larger goal seem less daunting. Imagine your child is learning to play the piano. The long term goal might be to perform in a recital, but the short term goals like our adventure quest could be as simple as mastering a new song each month. Each song learned is a level level cleared building confidence and skills gradually. Dr. John Sullivan, an expert in psychology, suggests that quick wins are crucial in maintaining engagement. In the context of childhood development, when children see results quickly, their eagerness to continue improves. They understand their efforts have a direct impact, which is incredibly empowering. This is what I call the power of quick wins. Let's talk about young boys and girls who be- begin their sci- bicycling journey at the tender age of 3 or 4. Initially, their adventure quest, quest was quite modest, like uh, bicycling radius was limited to the immediate vicinity of their homes. As they grow and uh, cycling skills improves, their radius of exploration expands progressively. In the beginning, short-term goals were simply to ride confidently on the streets near their house. Once they master that, they set uh, their sight further, crossing the road to exploring near neighboring areas. Each expansion of this biking territory was like completing a level in their personal game of life. By the age of eight, Maybe they go further to two two to three kilometers away from home and at 10, probably 10 kilometer radius. And when they grow up, become adults, like during 1920, probably they are planning trips, motorcycle trips with their friends to other cities, right? So this progression from simple rides around the block to planning intercity trips with friends beautifully illustrates how small manageable goals can lead to significant achievements. Their journey also highlights the importance of growing confidence and capability through gradually expanding challenges. Each phase of cycling adventure equipped them with the skills and courage needed for the next larger challenge. By setting and achieving these successive adventure quests, uh, children didn't just uh, learn how to ride a bike, they also learn how to set goals, manage challenges and expand their horizons, literally and metaphorically. This approach not only brings tangible improvements in biking skills, but also instills a lifelong passion for adventure and exploration. So your question will be, how do we set up an adventure quest system at home? that can be both fun and educational. You can create a quest board where each goal achieved earns a star or a badge. Celebrate each achievement no matter how small and review the progress together regularly. This visible record of success builds a child's self-esteem and reinforces the value of setting and achieving goals. Educational psychologist Dr. Emily King points out that children who practice setting and achieving short-term goals are better prepared for the complexities of adult life. They learn to strategize, prioritize, and manage their time effectively, skills that are invaluable in the long run. Well, as we wrap up today's episode, remember that every big achievement starts with one small step. By focusing on short-term goals or adventure quests, you help your children navigate the path to their dreams with confidence and joy. 
Thank you for joining me on Mind Lore for Growing Minds. Growing Minds. In our next episode, we'll explore more tools and strategies to help our children thrive. Until then, keep guiding your little adventures through their quests and celebrate every level they conquer. Thank you. Bye bye.